On behalf of SPUC, I'd like to wish all of our supporters a happy and holy Christmas. The joy of this season gives us great hope in the work that we do in defending the right to life. And we've had many reasons for encouragement this year. We've greatly expanded the work we do to help the most vulnerable. Our Alma Mater initiative is now helping young women in crisis pregnancies across the UK. Our education outreach is also making sure that youngsters are learning the truth about the development of the baby in the womb. We've expanded our youth work to reach more young people and our branch development team is having significant success in growing our number of branches. This gives us great encouragement and we also think that cultural change is around the corner. In the USA we saw the Roe v Wade decision being overturned. That introduced widespread abortion in the USA and now it shows that change is possible and we believe that change is coming to the UK. However, that decision also prompted pro-abortion activists to wage further attacks on the right to life. They are absolutely determined to have abortion to birth for any reason. And at the same time, we've also seen modern day Herods wanting to snuff out innocent human lives with proposals for assisted suicide. But SPUC has done everything we can to respond to these challenges. We've increased our parliamentary team, we've increased our research team, we want to make sure that politicians are hearing the facts to make sure that they make the right decisions that defend life. Now that works only possible because of your support. At SPUC, we see you all as part of the big SPUC family. So at this time at Christmas, we want you to know that you're very much in our hearts and in our minds. Have a wonderful time this Christmas and be assured that next year we will continue our fight to make sure that every human life in our society is nurtured and protected.